Okay, welcome to your tutorial on what is a natural number. So, oop, a natural number. Now, a natural number is actually very easy to understand. It is basically, you could look at it as a counting number. And it's also a whole number. We have to be careful there because there are whole numbers that are not natural numbers. So just realize it is a whole number, but every whole number is not necessarily a natural number. Um, but this definition here, the counting numbers, is more specific. And what I mean by that is, for example, well, firstly realize that numbers themselves are tools. And just like any tool, like a hammer or um, a piece of software or anything, it was invented by someone and it was designed to serve a certain purpose and basically it was designed as a solution to a certain type of problem now the problem or the purpose that we're looking for with the natural numbers or the counting numbers was basically to count things which is why I say they're the counting numbers so as an example these types of numbers would be or included in this would be one two three four dot 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 all the way up to a thousand dot 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 to 10,000 dot 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 all the way on to basically infinity so any number that is positive if you know what that means it has a positive value and um, is a whole number so you see all these are whole numbers they're not fractions or decimals and if you look at it it's a counting number so they're used to count things so for example back in the beginning of whenever this number was invented people needed to be able to count things so if they were at the market perhaps and they wanted to be able to count up all their beans so they could trade them they needed to have a symbol to write down uh, so they could keep track of that so you know maybe if you had let's say uh, you counted up all your beans and you had twelve thousand and thirty three hundred and seventy maybe you wouldn't be able to remember that so you'd want to write it down so having a number like this a counting number or a natural number would allow you to keep track of that and um, yeah that's the basic purpose of this so the natural numbers were designed to be able to count things and um, yeah that's basically it uh, the next video will be on the integers and you'll see how that differs from a natural number okay thanks for watching remember to subscribe and rate and favorite and leave a comment if you enjoyed the video thanks bye